What we have today is Gina Eskimo. I just put her together this morning. I, this outfit, this outfit, this Eskimo outfit was sewn, designed of course, and sewn by Mary Jo. And I want to tell you something. I, when I get back in October to Homo Sasa, because I'm going to be gone, this is the last doll I'm offering on eBay for the summer, I uh, will open a school of doll making. But not just the school of doll making, it's Betty Jo Neighbor School of Doll Making. And we will have doll making classes specializing in wooden dolls, of course, and uh, the patterns and the sewing and everything that goes with the school. I will have several different uh, teachers. I'm not into sewing, but my strength is more the, the uh, wooden parts. Uh, Staining, the sanding, the uh, finishing of the eyes, and the hair. Like this one, I put ute hair on it. I love this ute hair. This ute hair is, is earthy, it fits to the wood, and it's just perfect. There's a phone call. I just gotta answer that. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back, and I brought some ute hair with me. We talked about it earlier. I feel it would be a sin to put a wig of synthetic hair on any of my wooden dolls. So I stick with natural fiber, like ute. Ute is a beautiful fiber, let me show you. This is, ute comes like in, uh, like a rope type thing. Or I've, in the past we used a lot of burlap. This is uh, burlap which is uh, also a natural fiber, either bleached or dyed. So in, achieve different colors. Like here, you see, this is one of my experimenting silicon grin with ute hair. You see the, the beautiful fine, you have to comb it out. You know, you start out with this uh, woven row of rope, and then you have to fray it, first of all, you know, untwist it, then comb it out. It's a little bit of work. But then you end up with something natural that fits to the wooden style of the dolls. Now here is Gina. I highly recommend her. It's a beautiful outfit. She comes also with a neighbor kid stand. The nice thing is with these neighbor kids stand, they fit exactly to the neighbor babies. We call them the neighbor babies, which, well, they kind of balance them a little bit. We call them the neighbor babies. The, the bigger one, the neighbor kids, they don't fit on this stand. So this is Gina. Beautiful outfit. Take a look. You would hear the little mucklucks. And uh, yeah, it's, it's, a, it's a great Eskimo outfit. By Benny Jo. Natural fiber. I'll see you this fall. And I hope you have a nice summer. If you want to come down to the convention, it'll be in March 2015, the event.